What is up everybody? Thank you for coming to my brand new video. This is gonna be New Heights part five. Gonna be hitting a deadlift day, but it's gonna be tomorrow. I gotta go do some work for my gym. I'm gonna run the front desk and do, you know, just kind of like get my word out there. I like telling the people who come in about my business and what I do. And uh, tomorrow is gonna be the day that I deadlift. So if you like this stuff, make sure to like and subscribe. And uh, I'm about to go to work, so I'll see y'all after. Got me the pizza, gonna get carved up before we go into the deadlifts tomorrow, and we're gonna destroy them. So let's go. Just got to the gym again, walking in. Uh, finally time to hit those deadlifts. Super excited. I think I'm gonna throw up something super good. If you really like these types of videos, like I said, like and subscribe, and uh, we're about to get started. Here we go. Right now we're warming up to make sure everything's going and firing on these deadlifts. I'm gonna work up, like I said, to like a 600 plus. I'm not sure where it's gonna be, but it's gonna be somewhere up there and uh, I'm feeling pretty good. So let's see if it's just a feeling or it's the thing. So I know that last video didn't really show a lot of the 315, it was just the bottom angle of it but it's crazy to me because double overhand, which is having your thumb over your fingers, 315 for three with that grip is, I'm pretty sure a PR and I deadlift 700. So you see where my priorities are. We got 500 on the bar. Uh, the warm ups are feeling really, really good so far. So. Only up from here, let's go! The six plates move better than I could have freaking thought, to be honest. Like, God, that's sick. So I'm about to go up to 635, pull that for a quick single. Depending on that, I'm gonna go 645, 655, RP is seven. Okay, so 635 moved really, really good. I got a four by four now, RP is seven. I think it's gonna be around 545 if I had to guess. So now it's the bag down work. Then obviously we're gonna do the bodybuilding stuff to get these puppies growing. A little bigger than what they are now. Daddy, chill. What the hell is even that? Okay, this workout beat the crap out of me. I ain't gonna lie. But now that we're finished, look back on it, it was good. It was good. So now we're gonna do the bodybuilding stuff, such as chin ups and uh, I think some cable rows. But I might be wrong on both of those. I gotta look at my program. You'll see. Two hours later. Okay, so let's talk. What's up, dude? 
<laughs> What's up, man? <laughs> I just don't see how I would, like, I don't know. Like, the only thing that I consider that intimidates me is if they've got, like, like bigger muscles or if they're wearing, like, freaking, or if they got, like, tattoos and leather jackets and crap like that. Because so I the just first think they're thing, a biker. So, like, I intimidate you? No. Okay, not at all. <laughs> if I had a big dog, you'd be scared. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'd be less scared. I'd be like, he needs protection. I don't feel this. Because <laughs> if you see a big jack, they walking a chihuahua he's more approachable yeah i would say that and i but i would honestly if i saw somebody walking a chihuahua i would envision like hyped up khakis belt tucked in <laughs> <laughs> polo shirt and be like well he like you wanna bet my dog this is what i would envision would you be intimidated by a guy with a cat <laughs> oh you meant the animal <laughs> What do you call a deer with no eyes? I have no idea. But wait, it gets better. What do you call a deer with no eyes and no legs? I still have no idea. Call me. <laughs> we're here, we're here guys, we're here. We're getting a microphone. Don't forget to like and subscribe so we Drop can go. Drop the post notifications, hit turn the bell. Turn that bell on. Turn that bell up. Yeah, turn it up so loud your neighbors can hear it too and they subscribe and uh meet us at best buy right now we're in best buy me and old samuel he's walking in front of me god what a view <laughs> can't look because i'm the bodyguard yeah he's protecting my frail and petite body even though i outweigh him but we're looking for a mic for this channel so we can start clipping up we're gonna start interviewing women and guys come on quit being sexist what are you getting? Let me get out of this Scrambled. Oh, yeah. So we just ate Chipotle. I wound up getting a burrito that was like <laughs> so freaking hot. I can't even explain it. I feel like I'm 200 degrees. This was the first time Sam's ever had it. So we had to get him on the grind. Uh, what would you rate it? Oh. Uh, I think it has the potential to be an eight or nine, but I'm not a huge fan of spicy stuff. And it was spicy. Dude, those things were like, that sauce on it straight up ripped me a new one. Cause like now my lips feel like super swollen. Dude, I feel like I can barely breathe. It was so spicy. <laughs> Hi, right, Danielle. So, question for you. Give me some infinite wisdom on working out. Smile. There we go. That's a good tip. A lot of people forget about that one. <laughs>